Good morning to every one of you. Today, I will discuss about the history of volleyball and the drills for volleyball. Volleyball was invented in 1895 by William G. Morgan, physical director of the Young Men's Christian Association in Holyoke, Massachusetts. It was designed as the indoor sport for businessmen who found the new game for basketball too vigorous. Morgan called the sport Nintonet <clears throat> until a professor from Springfield College in Massachusetts noted the volleying nature of a play and proposed the name of volleyball. The original rules were written by Morgan and printed in the first edition of the official handbook of the Athletic League the Young Men's Christian Associations of North America, 1897. Let's start to discuss all about the volleyball drills. Setting, it can be done to either dump the ball over into an independent spot or to set the ball into a position that allows the hitter to spike it over. The volleyball dig can keep your team in the game and is a key skill to develop. When the ball is attacked by your opponent, your job is to keep the ball from hitting the floor. A dig pass is a pass of a high driven ball from another team, like a pass your arm position and a platform remain the same. It is important to keep your knees bent and remain in a low stance for your ready position. You should be lower than you are to receive the serve. In volleyball, spiking is the act of scoring a point by slamming the ball over the net into the opposing court effectively and aggressively. Blocking is a skill in a volleyball used to prevent the opponent from a successful attack hit.